and breaking right now on CBS 2 News at 5, beachgoers in Huntington Beach watch in horror as a plane crashes into the Pacific Ocean. Wow. Good evening, everyone. I'm Pat Harvey. And I'm Juan Fernandez in for Jeff Vaughn tonight. That plane plunged into the ocean just yards from the beach. Which was packed with people on this warm mm -hmm. summer day. CBS 2 Orange County reporter Michelle Gili is live in Huntington yeah. Beach, where a lot of folks captured the crash on their mm -hmm. smartphones, Michelle. That's right, you guys. The FAA has been here on the scene examining this smashed up plane. And this is an incredible story on so many levels. The pilot is okay. But imagine this. He crashed in front of hundreds of junior lifeguards here for a statewide competition. At the time the pilot went down, officials are telling us there was a break in the action. Had it happened a few minutes earlier, he could have landed right where kids were racing. He drifted down. It wasn't like he went nosedive in. He just floated right in. And straight into the ocean, the pilot, who was towing oh. a banner in the sky above a packed Huntington Beach, went okay. down around 1.30 Friday afternoon. Oh, it's going to the water, guys. Oh, dude. Bride-to-be Abby Crimmins from Missouri watched it all with her bridal crew on the sand. Bachelorette trip. I have everything set up, so beautiful. All of a sudden, plane falls out of the sky into the ocean. No one even knows. Like, we thought we were paying for the ocean. We're paying for a show. The plane falls in the ocean. It was crazy. This was all happening on Huntington State Beach, south of the pier. He appears that we were sitting on top of the uh, plane when he uh, appeared he was sitting there and they were able to get him out. Um, and like I said, he walked, he was able to walk out. Uh, so it was very. Yeah, just a normal family beach day, and who thought that a plane would crash right in front of us? <laughs> yeah, it was quite an experience. The single engine Piper Cub crashed right in front of 750 lifeguards in training who were taking part in the California Surf Life Saving Junior Guards Championship. Several teenage lifeguards and instructors grabbed boards and ran into the waves to save the pilot. When we got to the aircraft, he was outside of the cockpit sitting on top of the wings. Um, he was saying, no, there's no one else in the cockpit of the airplane. I am the only person on this airplane. That was our first most important oh! question. Yeah. Uh, he looked like he was in a, a plane crash. Yeah. He didn't seem to have many very life-threatening injuries, but he was treated on the beach by paramedics. Once on shore, the pilot was seen with a neck brace in the back of a lifeguard truck. FAA records show the plane is registered out of Florida to an aerial media company. Anytime you hear of an incident like this taking place, it's always a little, a little scary, but fortunately there were no injuries, no, at least no serious injuries, and I think really the best kind of outcome you can expect. Indeed. Now you're looking at a live picture of the banner that the pilot was towing when he crashed into the ocean. We do not have a cause as to what happened here. We also don't know who the pilot is, but again, he is doing okay. And Pat and Juan, as you can imagine, here at the beach, and I'm going to have Tim Kimball swing over, this is quite an attraction, the fuselage here that is parked uh, right here in the middle of the sand. There are uh, scores of beachgoers who are coming up and posing for photos in front of this, and, and people who don't know what happened are so curious, and of course, we're all sharing this incredible story. That's the latest live in Huntington Beach. I'm Michelle Gealy. Back to you. What a day at the beach. Thanks, Michelle.